quite often when you hear therapists talking about people going through the grieving process, they say that there's uh, the anger stage, the denial stage, the depression stage, the bargaining stage, and finally the acceptance stage. Most people in this country voted to leave the EU, and I think some of the Remainers are still at the anger and denial stage. There is a very clear set of ideas as to what we do next. The good Lord may not like them, but I think there are perfectly good arguments in that document, which I'd be happy to send you, to explain what it is we can do next. Douglas, can I say that this argument about bereavement is one of the most patronising <laughs> statements I have ever heard? But who's patronising to the 52%? No. Look, who's can I also be clear about this 52%? We have a democracy where you accept that there is a process. You accept that that means that when it goes against you, you do not start refusing to pay your taxes. You do not have a right to violent rather than unpeaceful demonstrations. But on the day after a Labour government is elected, Tory party activists and MPs decide the very next day that their main aim in life is to make sure that at least within five years that is reversed. And the idea that they should go into Parliament and vote with the Labour government because that is accepting the will of the people is absurd. I completely accept, as a given fact, that we are outcome? going to leave okay. the European Union. That's good Union. of you to... I am completely to accept hear. that we are going to leave... Well, uh, when you say it's good that you accept, that well, supplies that I wasn't going Liz to. Liz I've always suggested that we to. shouldn't accept it. What? Liz seemed to suggest that we shouldn't accept Look, it. Look, what I am suggesting is that if it occurred over the next year that there was a turn of events by which on February the 21st next year we had a referendum that went 52 to 48 percent the other way, that would be equally legitimate as the one that went 52 to 48 percent. So you want that second way. referendum? Uh, look, Have I you... think there is almost no chance of that occurring. But to suggest that it's somehow illegitimate and undemocratic for some people to want that suggests that I think you don't really understand democracy. Uh, having been. Okay. Let me bring you, come back and then I'll bring in other people. Commons, my Lord, because I've been elected there, not because I've been appointed there. I and, do and, understand and you, the and you always, okay. you always okay. voted for the government in power, whichever it was, did you? No, that I, was your interpretation I, I, of democracy. I got to Parliament through the ballot box, my Lord, not through appointment. Okay. Let me bring in other people. Let me bring in other people. You'll have a chance to come back.